morning students i hope you all had a restful and a relaxed weekend i hope you all are all back happy and healthy to attend class here we have completed lesson 4 we are moving on to lesson 5 the kind hearted villager children do you always help other people do you help people in need okay if you do that it is a very good behavior because it is important to help people in need okay so you have to be careful about people who are taking advantage of you you must not allow that to happen but at the same time it is important to be helpful and kind to others okay only then we will get blessings from god all right because the the uh, world is a full circle what goes around comes round all right so if you do good things for others if you help others you will also be helped and blessed at the same time okay so it is important to be kind and helpful to others come let's learn a new lesson the kind hearted villager in this lesson we are talking about a person called mohan lal okay yes it is not the cinema star mohan lal this is a very simple man his name is mohan lal and this man is a merchant merchant means a person who does a business okay so he was traveling by train one day and you know those who have traveled by trains will see that in every station the train stops and there is a place where you can go and fill water right so this man he got down at one a small station and he wanted to fill his water bottle so as he started filling the water bottle the train slowly started moving it started moving ahead okay so he ran towards the train in order to get into it but missed the train so he decided to find a place to stay that night because the train has left him and he is standing in a small station so come let's find out what happens to mohan lal okay so please take your text and go to page number 37 lesson 5 the kind hearted villager yes once mohan lal a merchant was traveling by train he felt thirsty as the train reached a small station he decided to get down and go in search of water yes so like i told you earlier mohan lal was a merchant he had his own business he was traveling on the train and and in his journey he felt thirsty okay so what happened as the train reached a small station mohan lal got off the train and went in search of water okay where he could get water however just as mohan lal reached the water tap the train started moving okay so as soon as he reached the water tap to fill water the train started leaving the station now that is a very dangerous sign okay he rushed towards the train but missed it since there were no more trains that day he decided to find a place for a day's stay mohan lal searched the entire village but could not find a vacant room in any of the lodges as he was searching he came across a small neatly kept hut okay so what happened mohan lal decided that okay the train has gone it has left me here now there is no other trains on that same day so he decided that he will stay in that station so in that entire village he searched for a small place to stay but there was no vacant room okay and as he came searching he found a small but neat little hut a hut is a small dwelling place okay mohan lal knocked on the door of the hut 
Mohanlal knocked on the door of the hut. Okay, so we will stop here. I will give you the new words in this lesson. Please note this. Now we have four new words here that is search, lodge, moving and merchant. Okay. So search is S-E-A-R-C-H. Search that means to look for something. Lodge, L-O-D-G-E. That is a staying place. Something like a hotel. Okay. Moving means a thing what is moving. M-O-V-I-N-G. The last one is merchant, M-E-R-C-H-A-N-T. That is a person who does a business, all right, who has a shop of his own. These are the new words. I want you to note this down in your rough book and learn the spellings. I hope you have followed this lesson. We will continue with the other half in the next class. Thank you all.